colonist has died. Oh my god! <laughs> Hello there you guys, it's Miss Charlotte here and welcome back to another episode of Surviving Mars. Now, quick disclaimer, I may sound very different and kind of gross, I was debating whether to make a video in the first place, uh, but at the moment I'm really ill. No, I don't, I'm pretty sure I don't have uh, corona, because uh, I know that is like the hot thing to go to right now, as soon as someone's a little bit ill everyone's like, oh my god you've got it. No, I literally just have a bit of a blocked nose and um, yeah, that's about it really, just feeling very bummed up at the moment. Uh, but I should be back to normal very soon, hopefully for Wednesday's video. Uh, so bear with me for this one because I'm going to sound very gross. Uh, but as soon as we're in, we have a refugee crisis. Let's have a look. So recent political turmoil on Earth has driven many refugees to seek shelter as far from the mother planet as possible. Accepting some refugees in the colony will generate both funding and good press for us, which is good. And social transitions are never entirely smooth though. Uh, there's a hint refugees are untrained for life on Mars and will initially have reduced work performance at all jobs. That's a given, I guess. Uh, so some of them may have trouble to adjusting to the Martian lifestyle and may become rene ren renegades. What is a renegade? Is that like a, a rebel or like disruptive? Well, I don't know what that means. Anyway, so we have a few options here. So this is like properly the first kind of like decision we have to make in terms of like the storyline. So we can either grant asylum to some of them so that's 10 refugees and 200 million dollars or we can do as many as we can which is 20 more so 30 and we get 200 million so it's the same amount of money but minus five colonists morale for the next 20 souls now i feel like days go quite slowly in this game so i'm not feeling that one or um commander profile not politician mars is not a place for untrained civilians and then minus 15 for all colonists uh for the next 20 souls or oh if we were a politician we'd be able to make a tweet to distract the journalist but i think we should grant asylum to some refugees um because if stuff starts going wrong i don't know it's an added challenge and i feel like we should at least take some of them and it doesn't have a negative impact so far so we've got a lovely red rocket coming down the refugee rocket uh, which is super exciting. <coughs> oh my god. We're going to have a lot of that. I'm so sorry. But Sprout Jr. is ready to land as we have 12 more passengers. Oh my god. I just realised. Taking on these refugees. We're going to have to have more food and more living complexes. So, going to have to work on that. So, that will... There's 12 in here. So, that's 24. And then there's 14. Oh yeah, we're going to have more than enough living space. It's just food, that's the issue really. We just need to get, actually with these uh, colonists that we've flew in, there's a few botanists, so hopefully our food's gonna be higher in production and more. Um, yeah, a high yield hopefully, so we shall see. Um, lovely. Come on, get to work people, we need foods. What are they? What are you? Are you, are you balling? Is that what that means? Hello? No? Hello? Can I click on you? What? What? Unemployed. Oh, oh, that's the issue, is it? Uh, well, let's do this. And let's. Oh. Can you not. Can you only. What? You can only have three people working. That's a bit shite. Oh dear. Right, let's make another farm, maybe? Should we do that? Previously, I've done it and I've got multiple farms, and then it, like, went really badly because we didn't have enough botanists. I think we do if that's going to be like that. Maybe we should get one of these farms. What is the benefits again? Um, workers, consume water. The cost is lower. Three workers. So this can take six workers. Maybe we should do this. Why not? Let's give it a try and we'll see. Uh, research is going well. Brilliant. We've got another empty slot. Uh, what are we thinking? Hmm, that's probably a good idea. Let's get our botanist living it up. Right, can we build this please? Hello? Anyone? Do we need our, what do you call it, our rover closer? No, we've got people close enough. Oh, is it because that's all the way over there? Ah, oh, that's really annoying. Okay. Oh, we probably need another one of these. Actually, that covers such a large area. Let's get you to, hello? Drive over here. Hello. There we go. There he goes. Look at him go. Just, just a casual fella, a blue fella now. 
I like him. They're cool. I like our little rovers. Uh, so there we go. Hopefully these guys now get this and move it over here. Or move it to there anyway. Yeah? Sure. I think so. Let's see. Where are you going with that? Oh, oh, I think he's, I think he's delivering. Okay, that's good. That's fine. Um, and then, <clears throat> oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. This is just a mess. This is why I don't want to make a video. I feel like I'm going to sound so gross and everyone's going to be like, girl, you nasty. Stop talking, please. <laughs> oh, I don't agree. But, um, <clears throat> I really wanted to make a video and, um, yeah, so I thought I'd go for it. Let me, sorry, I'm just quickly setting a timer. So I don't um, film for an hour accidentally because I know you guys don't want to be subjected to an hour of this. That would be a lot. <laughs> uh, let's see. Doo -doo -doo. This is so entertaining. God, I should edit this one actually, uh, but I'm not going to. I do like making these Survivor Mars videos because I don't have to edit sometimes. And that's kind of, like I do enjoy editing, but um, I know sometimes it's nice not to uh so you have gathered exports oh i completely forgot so rare metals we use as exports to give us money we don't actually use them to build um <clears throat> so that's fine uh i guess it can take off them goodbye farewell weird rocket sprout junior bam there he goes uh cool so this is working and we have a scientist working and three botanists so ideally, well, our refugees, oh, speaking of, they have arrived. Uh, let's put them in our normal rocket landing place. They can maybe start working at the farm. Get to, to know how to be a farmer, which is brilliant. Let's have a look. So that's fully staffed. Nursery, there's no one there yet. Uh, research lab. Can we open that? Let me see. I might open that just in case. Why not? Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean... Let me, oh, lovely. New colonists have Yay, new colonists. I don't want you working here because you're scientists and you can work at the lab. There we go, that makes more sense. And we've got enough medics. Could we do with more scientists, botanists? Oh, okay, cool, that's a thing. Sure, people are just working randomly now. There we go, it's cool, geologists. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um, why do geologists even work? If you're gonna hate your job, I don't want you working there really. Oh, this is not ideal. We need more botanists. Can we fly over some more? Yeah, Sprout Senior. Let's do that. <clears throat> right. Let's start from fresh. Botanist. Enthusiast and a hippie. Fine. Who are you? Rugged, sure, and a hypochondriac, fine. Probably want some more scientists, survivor, another botanist. Are you a nice botanist? Uh, oh, yes you are. I don't know where I put you, but I put you. Um, yes, you're fine. Another scientist, hippie gamer, rugged. Another botanist, vegan, workaholic, yes. Um, what else? Another botanist. I feel like we're getting too many botanists now. Medic? Yeah, should do with a medic. Um, what did the older just even do? I can never remember. Oh, are they the ones that man the extractors probably? That would make sense. Engineers, not really sure either. Um, anything else? We've got a lot of the same things. We haven't got many medics. Why call it vegan? Alcoholic. I mean, we don't really want an alcoholic, do we? Another officer, composed fit, yeah. We'll, we'll have a fit officer. <laughs> oh, and another officer here. <clears throat> Anything else? More botanists? I feel like we've got a lot of botanists at this point. It's probably too much. Another scientist? Here. And maybe some no specialization ones. Uh, workaholic and a gamer, why not? Um, here are you, rugged and a nerd. Hippie gamer and a nerd, rugged. Enthusiast. There we go. I'm going for that. Should we also bring up food? I think it does that, does it? Maybe? I don't know. Oh wait, 
is this oh no that's out of how many i thought that was showing the demand which would be really helpful um <clears throat> yes launch anyway right i like that i warned you that we don't actually have enough residential things so here we go we shall get one. Oh, if i remember how to rotate there we go um <clears throat> there perfect okay that should be built uh and then hopefully people will be working at more what you call it <clears throat> jobs that are more tailored to them which we want oh my god my voice ah <clears throat> this is the world's worst video i think and the worst video i've ever produced anyway i'm so sorry anyone that's watching this no one i don't think anyone's watching this to be honest uh we're quite low on water let us make a new moisture vaporator let's put it over here hell yeah and then do -do -do. did i just hear a big boom that's not good uh doop and then let's get a water tank or a water towel and some more parts i think these are connected anyway aren't they yes and then boop cool let's get those built oh and you need a bloody power source of course you do there we go good enough what's not working why are you not working oh because people haven't unloaded stuff storage space is full oh what well, can people un undo it how about if we do this near it get to work people little droney things uh and yeah so i wonder how how is it going in the dome birth star oh yeah i forgot so there's also different things we can enable so we're accepting colonists in this dome use passages for services use passages for work and births are allowed that's fine there's four disabled work slots do you want me to open them then is that okay right yeah maybe is that okay three vacant work slots two vacant work slots okay we shall see are there any there's youth there's no children yet but i think we do get a what you call it a notification when someone is born uh males who want children oh there's two people that want children so who knows maybe a baby very soon uh let's have a look here no one's unemployed that's good uh still residential slots that are open few adults few middle-aged no children will be born why oh because the average comfort of all fertile couples is too low interesting what's the comfort here um funding received interesting oh ah from our rare metals brilliant do you like money i haven't even been keeping an eye on our money I probably should do because don't have that much i mean it is a millions but i mean still have to be careful um do we have any machine parts <gasps> have we run out of machine parts uh-oh uh-oh colonists are suffering from hypothermia shit don't feature heaters uh da -da 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 temperature decreases when power supplies cut oh dear okay that's not good <clears throat> i think it's because uh i don't know i don't actually know what happened there shit 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 um because that can't be built because there's no machine parts we definitely have enough metals so let's do that come on people build solar panels please hello hello can you can you work on that can you get resources and oh there we go oh but it's not daytime this is a mess <laughs> this is a hot mess they don't have power they're dying <laughs> well they don't have enough oh there we go is that helping are we gonna have to do um solar panels until we have enough um machine parts which we should get down right let's get a cargo rocket um and let us get some machine parts should we get like 10 15 maybe yes um and let's get some more of these and we don't have any polymers at all 
that's a bit bad. We've got enough of everything else, I think. Maybe some more drones. Five more drones. And maybe a sterling generator. Uh, and a machine parts factory. Maybe we should get one of those just so we can make... I think that's what where engineers work, actually. Let's get one of those. Uh, okay, fine, cool. Um, yeah, that is not ideal. And we've got new colonists who are going to live in this dome, I'm pretty sure. Which is not ideal. Oh dear. Right, um... Let me fire you guys. Yeah, we've got all botanists in there now. Brilliant, okay. Let me just check amidst this crisis uh, that we have enough people. Oh. I mean, you've got no specialization, that's fine. You're a geologist, don't really want you in here. Who are you? Engineers, fine. Medics, have we got medics in here? Enough medics? No? Okay, whatever. You guys can do whatever. And we've got people with no specialization working in the grocer. Cool, that's fine. Um, so what we need is more, oh, more officers and more medics. Oh, an anomaly. Right, let's get our explorer to have a look at that. Cool. Uh, and I think one of our rockets is ready to take off. So what have you got on you? Nothing except from fuel, so that's fine. Goodbye. See ya! I've got a lot of rocket travelling going on today. Lots! Uh, right, I'm gonna wrap up the episode soon, as soon as <laughs> we have this sorted. So we just need this rocket to come down and then I think we'll get a sterling generator on this bad boy. Um, because, yeah, it's not ideal. Not ideal at all. Oh, do you know why? It's because this is... Ah, oh, that's why! Because this broke and I just didn't even realise. This one's lacking power now. Well, not enough power for this. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. What's happening? Does someone die? No! He died! Did he die of like... Of old age? Or did I kill him? Oh no, this is a mess. And we have Earth sick colonists. This is a mess. It's because the comfort's low. Okay. Let me real quick build some things. Also, what is that noise? Oh my god, what is happening? Why have these all malfunctioned? Okay, get this down here now. Please save us. Oh my gosh, this is a mess. This is literally the biggest mess ever. Oh dear. Are departing. are departing? No! A colonist has died. Shit. Oh no. This ain't good. This ain't good at all. Right, let's get a sterling generator in here. Oh my gosh. Drones, please don't. Please, like, can you fix these? A colonist has died. Oh my god! <laughs> Everyone is dying. Everyone is dying. Oh shit. Okay, right, we're fine. But loads of people just died. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh no. What happened? Everyone died. Not everyone, but loads of people died. Oh no. Who died? I can't even tell. Oh, look at all these scientists we've got. Well, that was bad. Right, their comfort levels are really low. So what I might do before we wrap it up <laughs> is get them this. Well, that, yeah, that provides loads of comfort, actually. Let's get them a gym. Will that help? I'm so sorry, everyone. I can't believe I've done this. How have I done this? Right, let's also get some nice gardens and things. That might be nice to make people feel better about life on Mars. I can't believe, I've never had that before where people left. Like that is crazy. There we go, maybe that will help. Jesus, that is insane. We also have loads of low resources, including power and water. Oh my God. This is such a hot mess. Right, so five, why have they unloaded? Why can't the five drones come off? 
Five drones, please, please. Where are all the drones? Get off. Research complete. How can I unload the drones? I don't know. Hello? There you go. Now you've got a command center. Ah, this is what we do. Okay. So that's your command center. That's your command center. Uh, eh, eh, come back. <laughs> that's your command center. And one more. Where's your, ah, you're hiding. That's your command center. Cool. Um, okay. There you go. Off you go. Bye. God. This is a mess. And food's low. Brilliant. Right. Well, I'm going to wrap up the episode here because it's absolutely just a big mess. And I guess next time we're going to have to solve this power issue, get a, a factory. Actually, you know what? Let me get a factory built right now if I can. Because then we can get some machine parts being made. Uh, do, 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 do. Where is it? Production? Oh, it takes up a lot of room. I'm gonna have to do it in another dive. <laughs> oh, shit. Let's have a look. There's no residents in here, actually. Can I do that? Can I salvage it, though? I don't think I can salvage yet. Let's have a look for a second. Uh, research. Can I, where's the thing where it's like, drones can salvage. Uh, what would it be? Engineering? Oh, they're doing it right now. Okay, fine. <clears throat> um, let's leave it for now, but I'm definitely going to get things sorted next episode. Uh, but if you like the video, do give it a thumbs up and feel free to leave a comment on what you would like to see in the series. And if you're enjoying it so far, let me know some of your feedback. Again, I'm so sorry for this episode just being so horrible because of my voice and my disgusting noises <laughs> my my weird sick cold noises uh but yeah feel free to subscribe for every um what am i trying to say subscribe for videos every wednesday and saturday that's what i'm trying to say uh and i will see you guys in the next one bye